Yes, this fight uh, means for me very a lot, and I want it uh, I'm trying to be announced by Michael Bachman. I want to imagine. I thought that it's in my side, maybe uh, judges, and they will victory to my side. But I didn't think that I won uh, just uh, for knocking down the second one. You can, you can watch my fight, not all my fight, just a 10th round. Only 10th round of 12. And all judges gave victory to Andrew Ward. And you understand what happened. What do you think was going on with the judges? I mean, there's been a lot made that this is the last American gold medalist fighting in Las Vegas against with I three American judges. I didn't think about this. I couldn't imagine that it can happen at all. Yeah. You know. Just uh, was focused on this fight, you know, like, and. Uh, I lost my power in the second uh, part of the fight, and it was my mistake, you know, of my training. What, hap what happened there? When you say you lose your power, did you, you let your like foot I off already, the gas? I already or? said a lot, and I, I don't want to like uh, get back what yeah, happened. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, I'm already here, what's happening right now, and I, I want to think in, uh, about future, what I will do, you know, and yeah. wanna, what I will, want to do. <coughs> what will you do different then? I just uh, will be trained less than I did. Oh, you feel like you overtrained a little yeah. bit? Okay. Now, let me ask you this one, one other question about the fight is that, you know, you clearly have gotten a look, he's gotten under your skin or he's bothered you a little bit, and I know this loss has bothered you too. Do you, is there a fear that maybe you carry too much anger into the ring that it's going to change who you are as a fighter when you're in the ring, or do you actually need that anger? to be at your best. Uh, not... Понял, да? Mm -hmm. Он говорит, я знаю, как бы видно, что он тебя <coughs> возражает уже в последнее вот это время, как бы ты нервный на него, знаешь, как бы нервничает. Он говорит, ты не думаешь, что ты тебе не страшно, что ты можешь принести с собой вот эту весь всю ненависть к нему в ринг, и что это может как бы и повлиять твою боль, твоему боли. Sorry. No, uh, then I will be hungry and angry. <laughs> I will box it much better, you know. Because when you're mad, the matter you are, the better. I was not very angry last time. Very, not enough was angry last fight. But uh, just like, you know, I don't want to what happened with me, you know, in the, in the fifth round. Just like I lost my power, energy, like everything, my speed. Everybody saw and started to see Andre Ward into the ring after fifth round, right. after, in, in the seventh round even. Yeah. When I tired, he can he can uh, box it with uh, boxers who get tired. Right. You know, like I didn't feel his uh, four round at all. In the fifth round, of the first minute, like I, I'm finished. It was my mistake of my training camp. Do you feel like after he felt your power, that he boxed you differently, more cautiously, that he didn't uh, engage you uh, as much and tried to kind of steal those uh, rounds at the end uh, of the fight? После ты думаешь, что он начал боксировать по-другому, когда уже не видел, что у тебя нету, не стало сил? Yeah, he believed in himself, you know that, because he saw in the seventh round. And I say to him, like, what are you laughing? He's like, shut up. You know, like, I understand that. He, I saw that he's understand that I, I'm done. I'm finished. And he's like, believing himself that he can. He's right now uh, feeling good, you know, like, and he, he do much more comfortable than he did uh, before the seventh round. And he knows that he lost the fight, you know. He knows. And everybody knows. It's the most people. Not everybody, because his fans and his like family believe in his uh, 
uh, victory. And he believed in his victory, and he right now pushed everybody to believe in his victory. Come on, it's not, it's not like that. We know that you're ready for the fight and you're prepared for the fight. With this one, there's been so much more promotion, media tours. Is that distracting you? Is it just part of selling the fight? How do you feel about having to speak so much more to the public and the media going into this fight? We did enough for the first time too. Yeah, there's a, there's a lot more that was done for the yeah, first we, fight than you guys realized. Yeah, we did enough and I, I, I gave to anybody and to everybody interviews like a sign, took a pictures, you know, like for promotion, but like <coughs> we sell only what we sell, what we sold, you know. And I think that, that uh, people bought paper because I was into the ring, because he's a boring. He didn't fight with anybody except me on HBO paper because nobody will be paid for, for his fight. Seeing how many people believed in your victory in the fight, do you enjoy doing all this media now a little more than you had before? Because you're a very serious man. Do you enjoy going out and speaking more to people now, really knowing how they felt after the first fight? После боя, как бы много, много, многие репортеры писали, говорили то, что ты выиграл бой, а не он. И он говорит, как бы сейчас ты общаешься с ними уже намного лучше, как бы тебе. Uh, you know, I'm very happy that uh, people uh, has uh, their, you know, opinion, and if their opinion for me means a lot. If it will be that I lost the fight, I. Uh, I will be agree because it's the opinion of the people who saw from the side. But people say another thing that he lost, I will, I will drop, you know, and I agree too. Because like, I don't want to say that I'm the best. If people will say I'm the best, I will agree. If people will say that he's will best, he will best. He's the best, okay, I will agree. And it means that I'm working not enough in the boxing gym, I need to be and to get better, better, you know, like, to get and be best. Sergey. For me, very important opinion of the people, box, boxing fans. But he is not agree with the boxing fans, you know. He's like a put on, on his head crown, I'm the best, but nobody, he, nobody put him uh, that number one pound for pound. Kathy, uh, after the first fight, Sergey made a note of talking about how the were, all, all three judges were American. Were you able to, in this contract, get some kind of agreement that there could be at least one non American judge? When you got it, you were going to finish We asked, we asked, inside, because I thought it would be the best for everyone involved, but there would be no question. Where's he gonna train? I think he's going to a big bit. I, I don't know. I, I, we haven't talked about that right now. With as soon as we're done with. Uh, and what you said to Andre Ward went viral yesterday. We didn't hear what you said. We just heard be ready at the face. But I will finish with boxing career. You sure? Because like uh, right now, 
I'm already in the corner, like uh, I don't have a, I don't have a, like a, another way, just to, like uh, accept the uh, get victory over. By any means necessary. Yeah, it's necessary. What Wait. goes to your, what goes to your mind when Virgil Hunter is talking, Prince is talking? And you, you, you have to just sit there. I know Kathy wants to jump up and <laughs> you know. But what goes through your mind? Do you just want to get up and throw him off the deal? So, I mean, could no fear. Nothing. <laughs> yeah, you know, they, they, they said uh, uh, they can say, every, say everything, you know, because they are at home. And they speaking to the public on their native language. And, uh, for people with American mentally, you know, but I will see how they will, will be to say it will be in my country, but they never will go to my country because, because uh, Andrew Ward is a hometown champion. He never fought out of the UFC, never in the pro. Also, he has fought for the world title against Nathan Cleverly in Wales. He fought for Roy Hopkins right next to Philadelphia. He fought. For me, it doesn't matter, yeah. Canada twice. He is a world champion. Yeah, world champion should be fighting everywhere. Okay, I fought in your country last year. Okay, why why you doesn't want to fight in New York? No, they doesn't want to fight in New York. They want to fight in Las Vegas again. Because like uh, they have a big support, big support. Kathy, obviously, uh, Sergey wins. There's going to be interest in a trilogy. Is there a rematch clause in this fight? No, there's not. Uh -oh. And given the, how difficult it's been for the events and Rock Nation to work together, what happens if there is this? If we get to this point. I won't. Do it. I won't. We'll just do whatever the hell we got. I just, I hope I get to the point where we have to deal with it. Yes. Uh, you know, there's no point thinking about a third fight, we're doing the second fight. Yeah.